Hi, I am Rajana here. Now I am telling Keel Micro Vision 5. How to use Keel Micro Vision 5 as a Keel Micro Vision 4. In Keel Micro Vision 5, having two options. It, it can be used as a Keel Micro Vision 4 and Keel Micro Vision 5 having one more extra features. The Keel Micro Vision 5 is opened. Now project. Project. Close the previous project. Project new microvision project in desktop. I am creating new folder. New fold folder name is Irana Project. It's already there. I am giving different name. Project name is PZM. That's it. PZM. Then open that folder. Save the project name. Project name is given project. Then save. Here two options. Legacy device database. It's present in the Keel Micro Region 4. So it's having two options, software packs and legacy device database. Now I am selecting legacy device database. We are, I, are, I need to select the NXP. NXP LPC 1768. You can type here. 1768. LPC 1768. Then OK. Yes. Project is created. File. New file. I am going to type the code here. The file is save as save in same folder psw.c sw.c switch dot c then save after saving the file we need to type the code in keel microvision 4 this keel microvision 5 only this legacy device database one more option is you have to need to add the library file i already having this library file here system lpc 17xx this is copy now i am pasting this in my folder this is my folder i am pasting here after that you have to need to add the file in my folder system.lpc1768 file is there add existing files system lpc 17xx add then close after adding the main source file and this is library file you no need to type the library file this is compulsory you have to add from this file it will take all the register details and clock everything will be available in this library file using that library file code will be executing after adding the library file go to the option for target target 1 12 megahertz output create hex file then ok after that build target creating hex file 0 errors 1 warning the program development is completed i created the hex file using the hex file you can download into the board and you can see the output there this is simple program to switch on off led on on led by using keypad and make it off using keypad you can see the output of this program in another video the video name is switch output thank you